minutes after the hour. This morning, a little girl proves heroes come in all sizes. In October, Haley Kudrow was diagnosed with neuroblastoma, a pediatric cancer that attacks the nervous system. The treatment and its si uh, physical side effects rather have forced Haley to grow up very fast. But WHSV's Haley Harrison shows us Kudrow has an iron will on her side. Listen to her laugh. <laughs> Watch her dance. Look at those dimples a mile deep and you'll feel the joy of a little girl loving life. But one good look at Haley Kudrow, and you'll understand the resilience of a child. My hair didn't go away. We trimmed it all off. You just got rid of it before it went away. Yeah, it yeah. kept falling out. I, I wanted to tape it back to my head. We read her a story um, that sort of explained when, when something like this had happened, maybe she would lose her hair, and she didn't, she didn't really care. <laughs> Fighting an aggressive form of cancer, her innocence leaves her naive to the suffering and sadness of her disease. What's that? Is this my shadow? Her parents, Karen and Eric, carry the weight of knowing what Haley is up against. It's not the same as telling an adult they have cancer. Like, she doesn't understand that what could happen. So she just, she's not old enough to understand that, but she's old enough to understand what needs to be done to take care of it. Drawing her own blood and balancing treatments at UVA's Children's Hospital, Haley still sees the world through five-year-old eyes. It's snowing! If only we could all do the same. Let's finish my picture. Haley Harrison, WHSV. Look at Sunny. News 3. Look, see Sunny. <laughs> Haley is in Philadelphia this week for surgery to remove a tumor on her stomach. To learn more about her treatment and the landmark study she's a part of, tune in tonight to WHSV's 11 on 11 and visit WHSV.com. And all this week on Daybreak, just as you've just seen, we're bringing you the, uh, just a few of the local